Hi, this is Jenny Hill. Um, I am doing a uh, cultural commit to for school. Um, what it means to me is we're going to teach and learn different cultures and how they do things. Um, we will have many faces. We will have different cultures. And this is something that would really be good for schools is to maybe do like a culture day where kids can learn about different cultures and how things are done and maybe the location and food. Um, there, you are responsible to um, accept the differences for many kids. Um, you can talk to a child about what they're doing and how they would do things what might be different for them. Maybe they don't do certain things that we do or others do. And this is um, about a time that you would do not, like you would learn a lot about the child and how they um, work and how things will work for them. What would be the best for that child? How would you help that child succeed even when things may be different for them compared to what we do. Um, um, I will be one that I will like communicate and communicate with the teacher, the previous teachers, the parents, the friends, the family. Um, I want to get to know what this child is going to be like and how they work and what they're good at. And maybe even um, talk about some culture stuff with them about, hey, do you guys do this or, or do you do that? Um, just work with the child and make sure you're communicating to the parent about how things are done and maybe see if what they're doing at home, if they can bring it to the school, what the school bring it to the home. Um, that way they can do their best and succeed. Um, I feel like I'm going to be really good at this because I like to communicate with my parents. Um, I used to work in a Head Start and that's the main thing was to communicate with your parents. Um, tell your parents how the day went, what they did, what they need to work on. Um, it's kind of a, a push in the way I want to go. I feel like this is, um, something I've been told I need to do. <laughs> so for my culture, it's, um, God, God is leading me to be a teacher and he wants me to teach these kids and he wants me to make sure everybody succeeds. Um, I know I work with a girl now and I feel helpless sometimes. So, um, I'm hoping for the best so that things will work out for her and for me, you know, got to work both ways here. Um, I have done class dojo with my kids, um, with my two kids and Google classroom. This is another place where you can communicate with the family. You can tell them how the day is going. Um, you know, more things that is a little easier for others to access and do too. Uh, just a small app on the phone and you're good to go. Um, I know a lot of um, people have different holidays that they do. My thing is, is I would love to welcome the holidays in. I don't, anything, Kwanzaa, Hanukkah, Christmas, Easter. I, I want the kids to know that there is more than just the holidays that in the United States, that there's more around the world. I want them to be able to explore. I want them to have fun. Um, this would be a good time for kids to bring different things from different cultures, different countries. You know, I think it would be fun. A lot of kids usually like to do things like that, but mm, I would make my room very welcoming. Um, might have posters up. I don't want to overdo it because I know there's um, a lot of too much sometimes. So I want to make it good, but I don't want to make it 
bland. So it would be like a little bit of both. Uh, I would stick to a theme kind of thing in the room so that it's the same thing for the kids that need constant routines so then they know oh we're not gonna change just because so-and-so changes or this happens or that happens um, I would build the kids up make sure they're having fun um, I'm hoping all the fun that I can have with the kids and enjoy kids I know it's one thing I've really wanted to be as a kid and as I grew up it just kind of changed and then here I am almost two and a half years into my education and I am enjoying every minute I love learning new things um it's very good and I like it so I'm thinking that when, as I go as a teacher that I will make sure that everything is perfect for children we're all going to make mistakes. I'm going to learn. I'm going to teach myself. I'm just going to push myself to do my best for these kids. They need constant reminders of how good of children they are. So I hope this works and I will see you guys later.